Lovi Elias and Passion Java are two ministers claiming to be prophets of God, but in all reality, they are operating in divination and sorcery. These two are causing harm to the body of Christ, and any minister who is associated with them needs to get free of this deception right now. I have just written an article on the subject. I'm putting it in the description, or at least how to get to it in the description. It will not let me link it. This article uh, explains how to discern the spirit of truth from the spirit of error. It talks about uh, a prerequisite for knowing the truth and understanding the truth. It also discusses the testimony of Jesus and how to recognize the testimony of Jesus, which is the spirit of prophecy. Okay, this is how we determine the true prophets of God from the false, whether it has the testimony of Jesus. All right, so the article goes into a description about the ministry of both Lovi Elias and Passion Java. It goes into detail. It has video testimony that shows the fruit of the Spirit, whether they have the fruit of the Spirit or if they do not. And I can, I can assure you that the video testimony and other things that are broken down in the article reveal that the fruit of the Spirit is not in them. We have to stop judging by external fruit. Jesus warned us of this in Matthew chapter 7. Okay, we, Jesus says it's the internal fruit, the fruit of the Spirit, not external fruit. He said that many will come to him and say, Lord, Lord, have we not cast out demons in your name, worked miracles in your name, prophesied in your name? And he'll say, depart from me. I never knew you, you worker of iniquity. We have a lot of people saying, oh, well, you're, you're speaking against deliverance. I'm not speaking against deliverance. I believe in deliverance. I believe in the moving of the Holy Spirit. What I'm speaking against is rotten fruit, okay, that is destroying the body of Christ. That's what I'm speaking against. And we have ministers who are now partnering with Prophets of iniquity, prophets of lawlessness, prophets with bad fruit. Ministers are starting to promote the ministries of false prophets. And this is a major thing in the body of Christ is the deception. The Lord does not want his people being deceived. He does not want his sheep being damaged. 